Don't talk. It's, it's going. It's, it's so soon. I hear me clicking.
Because then, because what they're going to do is if it's a ground ball, I follow it, follow it to the person <laughs> instead of the play. Because they're going to follow it first. So if it's hit in the air, then I, follow, if I can follow the ball. Like so normally, the easiest way to follow like the ball when it's in the air is to look for the group of people who are moving. Got it? Is that going to Dude, I'm usually like ready to like catch that, but I you said like it was coming right to us. Right dude, I I dude I was I was like dude I was just like I was like I was like please I know I know but I just I, I was writing so I didn't even know where. Sounds like Sam has something in your Dude, I just saw the guy coming over and I'm like gosh.
Don't be on this one, please. Hello, and welcome to FK, or Frontier Community Access Television. Tom Albert Heckel, uh, Megan Self. And Iris. So Hopkins in the top of the first, they scored. They were able to score two runs on uh, Frontier, and with two outs down, as Tyler DeBrew struck out, and Tyler Bernaski popped out to the first baseman in the foul line. Um, Kevin Bauman then hit, got a hit over to third and beat out the throw. So there's a man on first with Liam Skrbisky Bannock, the batter. And the count, I'm pretty sure, is two and two. Check swing. Oh, never mind. It was two and one, so. That was a strike called. Now the count's two and two. Oh. And a couple pickoff attempts. That one almost got away from the first baseman. And we'll see. here comes the pitch. Strike three swinging, so two strikeouts. And that will end the bottom of the first. You're watching Frontier Communics' Delvin. We'll see you back in a couple minutes. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community. What is the. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. <laughs> Tom Albert, Megan Self, Al Keckel, Iris, and Luke. And. Hard hit ball, going to go into right field for a base hit. And that was. That was. Uh, Flynn. <coughs> um, nope, nope. That was James Fitzgibbons. Pickoff attempt. You only have the one battery, and it's in this. Shows Bun. Uh, by the way, by the way. 
The batter is uh, A. West. Tyler's going to try for another pickoff attempt. <laughs> Definitely had a couple steps in there. Shows Bunt going to bump back to the pitcher. Tyler will pick it up and go to first, so that will be one out. So West does his job, moves the runner over to second. And it is top of the order, so the bat is going to be Siaglo. And he is pitching. So, as I like to call it, it's a mano with mano. And it's going to be a hit back to the uh, pitcher, and he looks like he's going to get into a pickle over at third, and they're going to get him, and they do. So great play there by Tyler to catch the... The runner sleeping. So two outs and uh, man's going to be on second. So Siagla will go to second. And batter's going to be West. It's going to be a ball outside. It's going to be in there for a strike for West. Tyler's going to try a pickoff attempt. Ooh, good catch there by Tyler DeBriel. Not allowed to go to the outfield. And it's going to be low for ball. This count's going to be two and one. It's going to be a three and one count now after that ball. So two outs and hard hit fly ball into left field. And that'll end the inning, or end the top of the inning, excuse me. So no damage is done. And we will go to the bottom of the second. Score is still 2 nothing. Hopkins leads. Uh, you're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. Uh, the score is still 2 nothing. Hopkins with the lead. They jumped out on the lead uh, in the first, top of the first inning. So we are in the bottom of the second inning and the score is 2-0. Uh, batter is going to be Alex Kuczynski. And he's playing second base for the Hawks. See what he can do here. It's going to be in there for a strike. And then see, see also how it helps you just move in the way. So if, if he was too much in the way, I could have gone and switched. Why is that good? And here comes the pitch from Siago. It's going to be low for a ball. Count's going to be two and one. High fly ball, going to go out of play. Evens up the count, two and two now. Get straight right off the Subaru. Looks like it hit the foul ball of the car over there. <laughs> and a strikeout. So one out for Hopkins. And the batter is going to be uh, Aiden Drury. And that's going to be in there for a strike, so. That's going to be a hard hit ball. Going to get by the third baseman and a base hit for uh, Drury. Yep, and looks like the batter uh, is going to be Sammy Schreiber. Sam Schreiber, so man up first, one Don. Hard at ball, going to be f fair ball, so a base hit. Man up first and second, so... Another great hit by the Hawks, and only one gone, and man on first and second. So it's going to bring up Ian Spearns. And Ian Spearns is in left field. And here comes the pitch. Pop up, gonna go way out of play. And Siago to pitch. Nice cut, so two strikes on him now. As long as there's not a double play, uh, the batter on deck will be Dylan Martin. Uh, good hold by Spearance. Siaglo to pitch. That one's going to be in the dirt. Drury makes it to third. 
And there was no throw off. It just bounced off the catcher's chest plate, so. So. Man on, man on, uh, first and third. Pitch is going to throw it over to first for a pickoff attempt. Here comes the pitch. So the double play ball is still in effect. Count's going to be two and two. Shriver's going to steal, and they'll do nothing with that. But no need to steal because uh, Spears walks. So base is loaded. Dylan Martin with a big at bat here to come. So Frontier could do some damage right here, right now. Comes down to whether they really want it. Chicago pitch is going to be low and away. Here comes a pitch higher, high fly ball, and fly out to Chicago. So. No damage done yet. Two outs now. So, strike out and a fly up to the pitcher, but bases are still loaded. And that brings up Frontier's leadoff man, Tyler DeBrio. Here comes the pitch. High for a ball and inside. Base hit could score two runs. And tie this one up, so. Gonna be high for another ball, so count two and out. And here comes the pitch, another high ball, so three out. Siagro's gonna have to work all the way back here now if he doesn't wanna walk in a run. Here comes the pitch. And Dubria will walk, so one run will score. It's going to make the game two to one, so it's getting interesting early here. Now the batter's Tyler, Tyler to Bernoski, and in the first inning he popped out to uh, first baseman, and it was it almost hit us over here, so. Hard hit ball, third base gets by him. One run will score, two runs will score. And Tyler Branoski is going to make it over to second base. So a two RBI double for Branoski. Makes the score three to two. Frontier now back on top of that lead. And their first lead of the game. So Kevin Bauman's the batter. Count's gonna be 0 and, or 1 and 0. And foul ball out of play. And Bauman hits last at bat. He had to hit the third base and beat it out to first. So the count's one and one. And a base hit could score another two runs here, so. Ooh. Maybe a little outside for that ball. So, good hitters count, two and one. 
Yeah, the one that is the station's camera. So only take that. Uh, foul ball. All right. Another hard hit ball going to go out of play into the trees. The Subaru right over there. Oh, no. We were making fun of them. And count two and two. Ball is another foul ball. So long at bat for Bauman. And here comes the payoff pitch. Strike out. So that's going to end the inning. So damage done. Frontier now back up on the lead as they get the first lead of the game. Scores 3-2. to two. Frontier with the lead. We will see you in the top of the third inning. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. And the, the batter was uh, pretty sure it's Patrick. Uh, Fitzgibbons. Uh, and he flew out to he flew out to shortstop. So one out, and the batter's Flynn. His last at bat, I think he had a line drive to. Short stop. Counts one and two. Grounder going to get past the pitcher. Go over to short stop and an easy out. Two up, two down. As Flynn grounds out to short stop. And the batter is going to be back with the left fielder for... Uh, Hopkins. Foul ball. The count's going to be uh, count's going to be 0 and 1. So <laughs> that's 
It's going to be in there for a strike. Counts on two. Line drive, second base, one, two, three, and three up, three down. So three quick outs for Hopkins, and we will go to the bottom of the third inning, Frontier leading three to two. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. All right, hello, and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. Tom, I'm Megan Self, Al Keckel, and Iris and Luke. So, Liam Skrabisky Bannock is the batter, and the count is 0 1. That one's going to be in the dirt, and I'm pretty sure that was a curveball. His last at bat, he had a strikeout swing, so we'll see if he can change that here with a hit. Last time I saw him play, he. Pretty sure he went two for three. That was a hard cut. So count is 0 and 2. And here comes the pitch. That one's going to be in the dirt. Count's going to be 2 and 2. Actually, sorry about that. Siago to pitch. That one's another one in the dirt. So, I think it's three and two. Yeah, full count. That's going to be in there for a strike three looking, so. I think it was a little outside, but close call, so. Alex Kuczynski is the batter. His last at bat, he also struck out. So he, he's here to change that right here, right now. Swing and a miss. That one's going to be uh, swing and a miss, uh, and that one's going to be uh, a little outside, so hard to get that one. It's going to be in there for a strike, too, so 0 oh and 2. Oh, 
And Tiago to pitch. We'll see if he gets through the curve. And that one's going to go in for a base hit. So Gochinski reaches first as he just found the gap between short and third. So man on first with uh, man on first. One out. Batter's going to be Aiden Drury. His last at bat, he had a base hit to third base that just got through, got past the third baseman. That one's going to be in there for a strike, just on the outside corner, I'm pretty sure. Siaglo to pitch. Gonna be low for a ball. Counts even, one and one. Let's see if we see a curve ball here, one and one. And Gochin's gonna steal in the dirt. Ooh, just got in there. So, the throw was probably like around a second off, and the throw got in there, but the, the tag was a little late. So, Gochinski with the steal, man on second, and I think the count's two and one. Now it's going to be two and two. And kind of a hit and run. Gochinsi's going to reach third. It's going to get past him. Um, yeah, so Gochinsi's going to reach third. And Drury's going to get a base hit. As it kind of just trickled down to the shortstop, and he just couldn't get a hold of it. So, I wonder if they will. Um, if Drury will steal here. I mean, and Schreiber, Sam Schreiber's. So Drury's two for two, and Sam Schreiber's one for one as he has a hit to left field. So we'll see what he can do here. Here comes the pitch. Going to be low for a ball. Counts one and zero. Oh. Here comes the pitch high for a ball. Two and zero. We'll see if Siago can work his way work his work his way back here. Another high ball. So three zero. So I'm sure Schreiber will not be swinging on this next one. And here comes the pitch. High for another ball. Bases juiced once again. And, <laughs> and still only one out. So it looks like pitcher is going to do a mound visit. And they're going to take a quick break. So will we. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Scores 3-2. to two.
Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Dublin. Foul ball gonna go way out of play. going to be one and one as that one was just in the dirt um, strike swinging so still bases loaded one gone and the count is one and two so see I go to pitch <laughs> high for another ball Experience his last at bat, he walked, which inevitably he was one of the runs that scored, so. And. Counts two and two, here comes the pitch. Ooh. Low for a strike, but. He called it, so. Experience strikes out looking. And the batter will be Dylan Martin, who his last at bat, he flew out to the pitcher. Going to be in there for a strike. So, count zone one. Siago to pitch. That was... <laughs> the, uh, count's going to be one and one. Siaglo. And that one's going to be in the dirt. Two and one. Again, bases are still loaded, this time with two outs. <laughs> so that ball is a f foul ball. And that count's going to be two and two. And strike three. So Siago gets it out of it with the bases loaded. With street three strikeouts to get out of that inning. So score's still three to two. Frontier did no damage there. And you're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
sense because you're more likely to kill yourself. Well, yeah, but they don't want to have a child. Yeah, yeah, they are. Somehow. Yeah. Well, they don't, that's why they're yeah. in the state. Yeah, so the state. That was in on the game. Yep. All right, I'm bringing it back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hello, and welcome back to Frontier Team Access Television. Three to two, Frontier leading by one, and Bernoski to pitch. Just barely hung on there. Count is still 0 and 2. And he's fouled a couple off, so, and they've been right near the hand. Hands. Batteries, batters a lowest. He is gonna strike out swinging. Start the, start the, top of the, top of the fourth. So, batter's gonna be, Far Farrell. Farrell is the batter. His last at bat, he got reached with an error to. Uh, uh, second. Strike got in there. Oh, the batter's... Yeah, batter's flare. Fell ball out of play. Count is one and two. One and two. Here comes the pitch. A high for a ball. Did not chase. And it was a little outside, too. Hard hit ball. Short stop. Ooh, takes a nasty hop, but he gets him. So nice play over there by Tyler DeBriel. Two up, two down. So the last five batters have been retired. And it's going to be in there for a ball, I think. I missed that one, so shut the good job. Uh, grounder over to the first baseman, and Drury will step on first. So six, uh, so la uh, three up, three down, and the last six batters retired by Bernoski, so. That'll end the top of the fourth. Uh, scores still three to two. Frontier with the lead by one. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
you have one, one, uh... Welcome back in a hard hit foul ball by Dubriel. Dubriel's 0 for 1 with a walk. <laughs> and so the count's going to be 0 and 2 for Dubriel. We'll see if what he can do. Hard hit ball going to get up the middle. So a base hit for Tyler Dubriel to lead off the bottom of the fourth. So, grounder. And Tyler DeBriel is fast, so we'll see if he steals here. Pitcher steps off. Siago knows he's going to steal, and DeBriel gets in there easily. He was taking a big lead, though. Batters Bernoski, so it's the mano y mano I like to call it. Mano y mano. <laughs> and another pickoff attempt, unsuccessful. Tiger really doesn't want him taking that lead and. Dubriel knows he can. So, Dubriel takes off. He could be, oh, yep, he's safe, and it actually hits him. So, Dubriel reached second, and the count's gonna be one and one. And the pitch is gonna go up there and talk about it. <laughs> so one and one count. Man on second. <laughs> and Siago to pitch. Curve ball. Going to go out of play and maybe hit a car. Nope. Goes into the netting. <laughs> And gonna be a grounder, gonna go near the fan section. Frontier fan section. So, um. Uh, <laughs> Count's gonna be still one and two. Man on second, no outs. And here comes the pitch to Bernoski. High and outside for a ball. Evens up the count, two and two. So Bernasi still got to protect and swing at anything close here. Here comes the pitch. And he's fouled off a couple of them. He's just a little ahead on it. Because he's hitting it over near uh, their own dugout, so just got to wait a little longer and right hit right in the sweet spot. Here comes the pitch. Still another foul ball. Long hit at bat. Count's still two and two, and Dubriel's waiting on second for something to happen. Here comes the pitch from Siago. Hard hit fly ball. 
So let's fly out to the second bit or shortstop, excuse me. But <clears throat> on the other hand, Tyler Bronowski is has two RBIs on the night, so with a double. <clears throat> And now they'll bring up uh, Kevin Bauman, his last at-bat. He, he struck out swinging on the, but he had a kind of blown call there. Uh, oh, no, never mind. That was, never mind. Uh, <clears throat> and he has a hit to third base, and he beat it out that one time. That one's going to be back to the pitcher. And he looked Dubriel back, almost went over there, and then threw over to first. So now... Two quick outs right there after a long at bat. So it's going to be uh, bring up Liam Skrubisky. Man, I can he is due for a hit. He's 0 for 2 with two strikeouts. A little early, hits off the top of the bat and goes foul. And Siagolo. Ball in the dirt, and Skrubisky goes, so evens up the count. Oh, nope, sorry, it's 0 2. Really got to protect that plate now. Dubriel with a nice steal to third. So two steals from Dubriel. <laughs> and the count's still on two. Hard hit ball, gonna go into right field and a nice catch, so. That'll do it for us in the bottom of the fourth. Uh, and the score is 3-2. to two. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Max Stubbin. It is going to be a 0 and 1 count on Alex West. It's going to be in there for another sh for a strike. He didn't like the call, but 0 and 2. So one more pitch and 
He is out of there. Strike three swinging. He is upset. Three strike strikes from du er, Bernoski. So, an immaculate inning so far. It's going to bring up top of the order, Siago. And ground over to Dubril. And so that's going to be two outs. And Baranowski has retired the last eight batters. So moving quickly and doing a great job. And there for another strike. All he's thrown this inning is strikes. Five pitches, five strikes. And finally, I jinxed him, and that one's a ball. So one and one. High for a ball. And inside, maybe a little. Here comes the pitch. Foul ball out of play. Could hit a car. Ooh. Yeah, got him between two cars. So, uh, it's going to be a ball inside. Count is full, 3 2. Here comes the pitch from Bernoski. Strike. Th Ooh. Excuse me, he fouled it off. Bernowski to pitch high for a ball. And he will walk him. So I jinxed him and he retired eight in a row. But there's two outs in this uh, fifth inning. So... One more. I'm pretty sure it's. So it's the catcher for uh, uh, Hopkins. I bet. Uh, Bernowski tries to pick off a tub. And West gets back safely. So Patrick Fitzgibbons with a 1 0 count. And he is one, two for, one and two on the night. Hard hit, fly ball. Now he's going to be two for three. And he's going to get a double with maybe a run scoring. Yeah, one run will score. And so a one RBI double. So that was a great hit by Patrick Fitzsimmons, and that's going to tie this game up three to three, bringing up Flynn. And there for a ball. So the go-ahead run is on second base. As Hopkins just tied it up, hard hit ball, going to go to right field or center field, excuse me, and that'll do it. So, damage done. This game is now tied with that fly or with that double with an RBI by Patrick Fitzgibbons. Three to three. You're watching Frontier Community Access Dublin. We'll be right back.
Oh, hard hit ball. Welcome back. Uh, backing up makes the catch. So good hit by Gochinski and nice catch over there in right right field. So uh, bottom of the fifth inning. Uh, score is uh, tied. And batter is Aiden Drury. Fouls that one off. <laughs> Count is 0-2. Fouls that one off too, so three straight foul balls by Drury. Does a good job protecting there. Oh, bad swing and just just swung at one of those, those high. So two straight outs, two up, two down. Fly to right and a K swinging. So it's going to bring up Sam Schreiber. He's one for one, and his last at bat was a walk. Oof, and a nice cut there. And here comes a pitch from Siaglo. It shows a bunt. Going to go out of play. That would be two strikes on him. Here comes a pitch and does a good job foul, uh, fouling that one off. Keep it alive. <coughs> Grounder over to third. Nice play. And a diving save, but. <laughs> Could not get up and uh, throw that one over. So, Schreiber's two for two with a walk. So, uh, Bad is going to be in the spare, and she is 0 for 1 with his last about being a strikeout. And it was kind of a bad play. They're a bad uh, call on him. So, uh, and then it's, uh, back before that he walked and was scored a run, so. Ooh. That ball fouled off, hit the top of the fence and hit a car, so. Oh, it. Yeah, I was wrong. It didn't hit a car. It, it, it hit the top of the fence hit, and then hit the fence behind that one. So, almost hit somebody, though. <coughs> so, count is 0 and 1. Shrive is going to steal. Nice throw. High ball, though. So. Good steal by Shriver, and now puts him in scoring position with two outs. And Siago to pitch. High for a ball. And here comes the pitch. Foul ball. It's going to make the count one and two. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> so why are we live? What's wrong? Hold on, let me. Let's... And so, <laughs> a strikeout looking, another kind of iffy call, but that'll do it for the. Uh, Fifth inning. We will go to the top of the sixth. Scores still tied 3-3. Uh, three, three. And we'll be right back. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. Counts one and one. Ground ball to shortstop, and that'll be out. So. Your brother? No, my half brother. Yeah. So that will retire one of the outs. Uh, a lot of action over there for Tyler DeVriel as he's made, let's see, one, two, three, four, oh, f I think five outs, so. And that ball is going to be in there for uh, strike, so and one Grounder over to third base. Oh, he's going to have to pick it, and he throws it over. Not in time. Just a little bobble and... It is safe, so. <laughs> and so there's going to be time to make sure he's, he's all right. He may have just pulled something, so. Uh, we'll take a quick break. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
So he'll have a uh, Alois will have a pinch runner for him. Uh, I think it's number eight. It's number eighteen, but I'm not exactly too sure who it is. Counts two and zero. Oh. So man on first one again, one down shows bunt, and he goes. So two and one count. So a good hitters count here. Shows bunt and gonna be in there for a strike. Count's gonna be two and two now. We'll see if Farrell will get on. So full count. See if uh So that's going to be in there for a ball, so he walks him. And uh, Frontiers coach uh, is going to go up for a mountain visit, see if Tyler's. All right, so man on first and second. One out, and you're watching Frontier Community Access Television. Hello and welcome right back to Frontier Communities Dublin. A foul ball. So, man on first and second, one gone, and count is one and oh, no, oh and one. So, Bernowski to pitch. In there for strike three. So. James the chair let's go down goes down looking. And it's gonna bring up bottom of the order, Alex West. He last his last at bat he struck out swing oh hard hit ball right field. That could score a run. <laughs> he's waved around. They gotta get it in. Oh he's out. And he's out! He was what a play! So Bauman to Dubriel to Dylan Martin to get that out and makes, still makes this game tied. So, 3-3. Three to three. And we'll be going to the bottom of the sixth inning. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
Hello and welcome back to Frontier Connects Television. Seattle's first pitch was in there for a strike on Martin. Ball over to third base, bobbling around. Gets it over. Oh, off the bag, he's safe. So great job running it out by Dylan Martin and. So first baseman comes off, so. Yep, so both umps agree that he was off the bag. Yeah, we're going to go to break as we're watching Fred Dick Access Television. So, oh, Dubriel calls for time. He was right there. Of course he saw it. Right <laughs> Hearted ball, uh, fly ball, going to go into left field, and he'll be caught for an out. So first out of the bottom of the sixth inning. So... And batter's going to be batter's going to be Tyler Benoski. That's going to be in there for a ball. And second pitch is in there for a high ball. Ooh, Marin gets it right back in there. So that's a pickoff attempt, unsuccessful. Unsuccessful. One guy, man, on first, and still the game's tied, three-three. Bernaski, hard hit. That's going to drop in there for a fair ball. Uh -oh. And good job by Marnas. He almost was going to go head to third, but he was right in front of him. Good job. So, man on first and second base hit for Tyler Bernoski. Going to bring up Kevin Bauman. He's on his phone at his car. He's right there. He's directly that way. Hey, it's probably time to. Where's Mike? It's a parent. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll see if Kevin Bauman can get on here and maybe get the score that go ahead and run. In there for a strike. Nice strike. See if Siago can get get out of this. There's no damage done. Curveball gonna be up and inside for a ball. So count's gonna be one and one. Man on first and second. Siago to pitch. High and outside for a ball. Count's going to be two and one. Is he a knuckle? And that's going to be low for a ball three. So three and one now. So 
Kevin's only going to be swinging at this one if it's pitch perfect because he could load the bases for Skrbisky. And he was good enough to swing at, so foul ball. <laughs> foul ball. And full count, 3-2. See what happens here. Siaglo. Big pitch to come. Hard at ball, and that's going to be a double play as the second baseman just caught that liner. So. Nope, that's going to end the sixth inning. Score tied 3-3 three to three with that double play. Just great play by the second baseman, and... Uh, you're watching Fred to Community Access Dublin. Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. Tom Al and Megan Self, Al Geckel, Iris, uh, Gochinski, and Luke. So, counts one and one on Siaglo, and that's going to get in there for a strike. So, one and two count now, and it's that mano y mano, I like to call it. So another hard hit ball with a short stop and gonna be out of play, so he'll get second. Alec with a nice throw back to the pitcher and <laughs> So the go ahead runs, Yaglo leads it off. And lead off, lead off, <laughs> lead off, lead off uh, oh, sorry, lead off, man, reach a second. They're going to take a quick break, so we'll be right in front to give me access to them.
No. Nope. Welcome back. And the first pitch that he th Tyler threw to West was a ball. Tries to pick up attempt as it, oh. And it's gonna be in there for a strike. Counts two and one, pretty sure. Oh, it's one and one. Bernoski pitches, throws a bunt. He's gonna uh, be safe over at third, so the go ahead run now just one, 90 feet away. So, off of an error. And now, yeah, the infield's going to be in and the place to home. If it's hit to the outfield, it'll be a. Uh, Hopkins will be winning this game. Or, well, we be, yeah. We'll be, uh, just be ahead in the game. No outs, and he walks him. So, West pass to a bats. He's walked twice, and that's going to be bring up Patrick Fitzgibbons. Last at bat, his last at bat, he had a double RBI, which tied this game up. Now, man on first and third, and damage could be done. So. It's going to go in there for a ball. Hard hit ball is going to go foul and out of play. So count one and one. But I think if Bernasi is going to get out of this, he needs a double play. Scribisi is going to go home with it. And he gets him. So... An excellent play by Skrbisky to Martin, and Martin just gets just gets a tag on him. So, so now the now instead of the uh, go ahead run being at third, it'll be at second. So. With man on second and first, which tag any base except for home, and that's an out. So, gonna be high for a ball. One to no. Bernowski really trying to get out of this here. Hard at ball, gonna go foul and out of play. Comes the pitch right down the middle. One and two. One more pitch, and it'll be two outs. Foul out of play. Count still one and two. Oh, yeah, they're looking at <laughs> So, Flynn doing a good job of staying alive here. And just outside for a ball. It's going to make the count two and two. High for a ball, so 3-2. Huge at bat here for Flynn. Bernoski to pitch. Hard at ball, line drive, and that'll do a double play for Dubriel. And Frontier gets out of that inning. That inning.
<laughs> and with a double play by Tyler Debrio. Score is still 3-3. We will go to the bottom of the seventh inning. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television. <laughs> I just brought it back. Hello, welcome back to Pentecostal Texas Television. And uh, Liam Skrbisky is the batter. His last at bat, he threw out, to, flew out to right. But it's been the count's two and one, so good hitters count here. Siaglo to pitch. In there for a low strike. <laughs> Counts two and two. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> that sound. Uh, we're going to take a quick break. The ball just deflected and hit the wrong spot for the catcher. <laughs>
Our analysis will be back shortly. Welcome back to Frontier Connects Television. Patrick Fitzgibbons is going to be in there to pitch, and Gochinski is the batter. And ooh, and that one's going to be outside for a ball. So, one gone as Liam Sprichy flew out to right. It was a long fly ball. And 
Kochinski is the batter with a 2-0 count on him. That one's going to be in there for a strike. So now he has a hitter's count, 2-1. And, <laughs> and Fitzgibbons is on the mound again as Siago was taken out. Hard hit ball over to, to the fence. Oh, nice swing and <laughs> so count two and two, <laughs> count's going to be two and two and here comes a payoff pitch, Ooh. high and outside and he swings at it so two gone and this game could be going to extras. <laughs> so that one's going to be in there for a ball. We will see if uh, Drury can get on. He is two for three. Hard hit fly ball. That one. Going to be out of play. And way into the woods. <laughs> In there for a strike. And... Counts one and two. Low and away. Evens it up evens up the count two and two now. For Drury. Again, he has to get something on with the two out rally, and it's the bottom of the seventh inning, so. Leaves on that one. That one's low and away as well. So full count three two. We'll see if Fitzgibbons can strike him out here, or if Drury can get on. High for a ball, Drury walks, so. The winning run is at first base, so. Oh, that one's going to be drop. Oh, he caught it. No way. What an unbelievable catch by the center fielder out there. And they are pumped about that, which if that dropped, that was, that was the winning run scoring. So he saved the game there as uh, Schreiber flies out to center field. So that ends... The seventh inning, we will go to the top of the eighth. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
Hello and welcome back to Frontier Community Access Television. It's been an interesting game so far, definitely a good one, as uh, the game's all tied up 3 3 and it has been for the past two innings. So, top of the eighth inning, and the leadoff man is Flynn. Ground hit over to shortstop once again. Clean fieldy and a nice play to first. Gets him out. And fly ball. That one looks like it's going to be in play. Skrbisky waves everyone off, makes the catch, two gone. So fly out to uh, third base. And two up, two down. As Bernowski's hanging in there um, as he's pitched this whole game and going to extras too, so doing very well. Strike one swinging. Lois is the batter. Last time he reached on in the air and the third base. So he is. We didn't know what time it was. He is over three. It kind of looks like. <laughs> that one is going to be uh, gets past the catcher, so three and one count. <laughs> and here comes the pitch from Bernowski. <laughs> Strike three. So it was actually a 3-2 count, full count, but three up, three down. Bernoski pitching him phenomenal in this last couple innings. So we will go to the bottom of the eighth inning. You're watching Frontier Community Access Television.
Oh, it is Mama Nate Oh, it Welcome back to Front Day Give It Access Television. So one out as Ian Spears just popped out to the second baseman. Oh, I hate this place. <laughs> She's great. Uh, Batter's Dylan Martin, his last at bat, he had a hit to third baseman. Or he had a hit to third base, sorry. And he beat out the throw, and the first baseman was... Uh, off grounder to shortstop bobbles it Martin will reach first and the winning run at first base so hit the shortstop and there's one gone as the winning run is now at first top of the order Tyler Brio his last at bat, he had a long fly ball to left field. We'll see if he can change that here with. And that one's going to go foul out of play. Counts 0-1. Fitzgibbons. To pitch. Ball outside. Counts one and one. Man on first and one gone. A lot of first. Here comes the pitch. Debriel grounder to third. This goes foul. So one and two count now. And he's got to protect. And Fitzgibbons. Two pitch, here it comes. Martin takes off. Hard at ball, gets up the middle. And Martin's gonna go to third. He may be gone though. He's gonna be out, yep. <laughs> so. Unlucky as he Martins just runs into that out there and it was a great throw by the center fielder, so fielder's choice, but a hit by Dubrio. So two gone. Tyler Branowski now. Debriel will steal. And it's almost thrown into the outfield. And with that, Debriel. So now, winning run still on second. So a long fly ball and no play on it. So counts 0 and 1. And the batter is Bernowski. He is two for four. That one's gonna be in the dirt. One and one count now. If Bernowski gets on, Bauman will be the batter. And he last had an unlucky line drive to the second base. Hard hit fly ball. And he just is ahead of it. And that one.
Counts one and two. Here comes the pitch. Grounder back to the pitcher. Gets over him. Goes to second. Overthrow. And that's going to win the game. On an overthrow, Bernowski wins the game. An overthrow by the second baseman. And he, Bernowski is getting drenched by water. Or Gatorade. <laughs> <laughs> what a <laughs> what an epic performance by Frontier to win that game. So a walk off hit by Tyler Bernowski. He goes three for five on the night, and that'll do it for our coverage tonight. Frontier they pull off the win against Hopkins four to three. And for the final time, you've watched FCAT, our Frontier Community Access Television, Tom Albert, Megan Self, Alec Eckel, uh, Iris Gochinski, and uh, Luke. And we'll see you guys next time. Roger.